Yeah. Hello and welcome to the play date. I'm Chris Bird. I'm Laurie Leahy, and we're from TalkToPlayMag.com. And if you haven't guessed yet, we're going back to the excitement and the enchantment of the Middle Ages with <laughs> with Bike the Night. Now, I never thought of the Middle Ages as ex especially exciting or enchanting. No indoor plumbing. No. The plague came every summer. Yeah. Um, like you know, jousting. Well, well, jousting. But that was, you know. Yeah. Cast, if you won, it was Cast exciting. iron underwear. Uh, <laughs> or armor or whatever yeah. it was. But that's not how kids play because here we are in the 21st century, 500 years later and or we're more. We're still jousting. And we're still, <laughs> we're still jousting. What but can I say? But so we, we, we've romanticized and sanitized the... Yes. Uh, the, um, yes. Middle Ages, but there's a whole line of toys. Yes. Show is coming out soon on Nickelodeon. It's, yes, on Nickelodeon and Nick Jr. And, and what? It's out already. It's out already. already. Yeah. And it's also in the in in the UK and Canada. It is yes. on CBBS and Treehouse TV. <laughs> Why you sure know your we broadcasting our, facts? We did our research. We did our homework <laughs> right before the show. <laughs> We know Great. what we're doing. So, so go. Well, we're talking about the toy line for Mike the Knight. All of these toys are from Fisher Price, and Yay. they're all for ages two and up. Um, we've got some stuffed characters from the show. There's Evie, There's Mike, Mike, of course, his trusty steed Galahad, Sparky, the di or the uh, almost a dinosaur, the dragon, <laughs> wrong time period, and right. even Squirt, the dragon. Right. Dinosaurs. Toy dinosaurs. We have we have Sparky <laughs> and Squirt. Yay! But these are just soft little guys, really cute, cuddly. And do you do you learn chivalry? I would hope that they're learning chivalry. Sure. <laughs> Mike, please open the door for me. Never. Oh! <laughs> chivalry is dead. <laughs> chivalry is dead. Um, but again, you know, this is this is one of those shows that kids will really enjoy. It's a little bit silly, a little bit funny. Yeah. It's it's not really. Um, don't expect the Once and Future King or Camelot or um, no. you know Rugrats. Any, any of those or what Rugrats Rugrats Rugrats, well, <laughs> Rugrats isn't medieval video boy <laughs> Rugrats is a great cartoon oh, it is a great cartoon <laughs> okay so you've got the soft plush toys and we and we yes. got Mike is also a Viking I don't in know it's Mike and the Viking ship uh, this goes in the bath the, the oh, ship actually floats so is he is he medieval in Norway or is he medieval <laughs> in Britain questions to ask the development team. <laughs> these are questions for the ages either way you get a toy <laughs> exactly and it floats so you can you know play it around in the bathtub or in the pool uh, Mike is a water squirter so you fill him up and you can squirt him it actually comes out of the top of his sword here I'm All just right. blowing air right now. I, we might have squirt coffee. Should no, no, don't squirt coffee. We've got a, a squirting. <laughs> so that is about $14.99. Each of the plush friends is $7.99 sold separately. Then we have some role play toys. The sword and shield. Arr, got a nice little handle on the back with a thumb grip so it's easy for young kids to hold. What about a breastplate and a buckler? They have not made that yet. Those, I guess are, those are other pieces helmet. of armor. A helmet. A helmet. Right, exactly. I bet they're going to come out with a helmet. Don't you I think? I think so. Don't yeah, because kids want to dress up like Mike. A real steel helmet that weighs like... No, they're not yes. going to do that. <laughs> That's not what Fisher Price does. No. But this is really... Come on, this is really cute. Yeah, it's nine ninety nine. We've got Mike. We've got Mike's little thing there on the... On the uh, whatever. So, okay. whosoever pulleth the sword out of the stone shall be the true king of England. Okay, that's oh my a, gosh! Okay, that's a, that's, that's a different medieval story. It is. That's okay, that's though. That's a great one, though. We <laughs> also have some just figure packs. We have Mike and Galahad. Mike actually can ride Galahad. He's, he doesn't stand on his own, but he does ride nicely on the horse, which also has sort of a bobble head. And it comes with a little hurdle, so we can pretend to make them... Practice their jumping. They can even do backwards because they're so <laughs> Because amazing. you, you can do it. I've never seen a horse Magic. jump backwards. Well, I'm going to do it again yeah. so you can see it again. Ooh. Then you have your Sparky and Squirt uh, dragon pack. They come with a little pretend fire thing. And also have some bobblehead action. These are cute. I mean, these are really designed yeah. for for the two, yes. three year olds who are yes. into the show, who aren't very sophisticated in terms of in terms of fine motor coordination, mm -hmm. but who love the characters and like playing with them and make up different stories. That's right. them. And each of these figure packs is twelve ninety nine. 
I'm gonna move these out of the way because we have the training grounds, which is fourteen ninety nine. Oh, it's where he, it's night light. training? Night training. That looks actually. like a very 21st century night training helmet. It looks like a... It, it, it looks, looks like, like a jockey. A dressage yeah. helmet, yeah, I was going to say. Boom! Oh, I didn't nice it really nice job. Really I guess we need some training. What's he supposed to do? I'm supposed to try to get him to, up to these like targets and over this hurdle. He's supposed to get him over the bar. He's never going to make it. He's never going to make it, I know. I'm not very good at this. Ugh! No, he's too top heavy. You're never going to get it. He's too top heavy. Well, oh. this is the figure that they sent to Check our review. I know, you did You did do it in the review, right? So Do I just it doesn't, need more it power? doesn't even stand up here. Right? Ah! I'd yeah, say he's there that hurdle. Four-year-old to do that. <laughs> <laughs> but then he's also got a little slide. You should see me wrestle a four-year-old. <laughs> Um, <laughs> to you. Spin. But lots of lots of the, you know what they call this at, at, at Fisher Price? They call this stuff finger food. You know finger things. Food. Ah, yes. Things that kids can do with their fingers as they're exploring the different things. So that's, that's actually kind of cute. It is cute. But for even more play, we have the Glendragon Castle, which comes with Mike and his horse and all these fun little accessories. Um, this actually plays sounds and phrases. So if you press this button back here. Oh, nice. Press the button that people can't see. We'll turn it, we'll turn it around in a minute so you can see the button. So every time you press this button, basically, uh, Mike tells a different mission that you have to try to help him go on. So his mission was to glide from the top to the bottom on this zip line. Whee! And I'd say he succeeded. So now we can turn this around. face first. <laughs> and you notice, you notice there is no bathroom Here's here the because button. there is no, no no indoor plumbing in the Middle Ages. There are all sorts of different uh, hidden pieces of treasure that you can find. We can spin this around. You can open up this chest. What are you spinning that around to do? Is that a fire? Inside here is gold. Ooh, then you have your boulder to catapult. You can lift up. Don't sound a little more excited. We can... It's a boulder. You can catapult. <laughs> We can lift Jeez. up the. I'm too excited about finding the treasure. Look, there's hairbrushes and horseshoes <laughs> underneath the hay, and there's a slide. That's really girl his, treasure. His bed, okay? <laughs> his bed, lift it up. Oh, I'm waking up in the morning. Oh, and I'm going to go down the slide. Woo! <laughs> Every and, child's bedroom should have that. And look, if you look right here, I, I, I expect like the Keebler elves to come out of, <laughs> out of, out of this tree. Yes. <laughs> but instead, see, here's more hidden treasure. Look what you could find. Again, you know, this is a lot of really Door great discovery, opening. developmental yeah. stuff for kids. Things like object permanence, where they can twist it away but still know that the mic figure is in there. They're actually, it's a lot of play, a lot of fine motor play, but kids are actually developing real skills yeah. that are really, you know, that are really important for the whole story-based play. And of course, while they're while they're having fun and doing it, that's re that's really the whole point of it. All of our kidding aside. Yay! So I think this is really exciting. So. He's Mike. I'm Mike the Knight. Uh, no, I'm Mike the Knight. Well, let's give some stuff away. Let's do that. For no particular reason. A middle league medieval chicken! <laughs> it's, it's a rooster! <laughs> it's a medieval rooster. Okay, go ahead. Toss one. And we've um, got some little, uh, little, oh, little got, plush friends for you, Mike and Sparky. And here comes something big. Go ahead. Oh, 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 Mike and Galahad. Yeah. It's like a whole Mike the Knight prize package Sparky here. Sparky and Squirt! Okay, so you're going to... You're like, oh, and the training nice. ground! So you're not going to need to go out and buy anything if you win this package. You will have all the Mike and the Knight toys you can own, except for the castle. We didn't except have for the a castle. castle. Sorry. So you have to go out and buy that. But hey, you know, if you win all this, that's okay. So right. to win this, you're going to go to timetoplaymag.com and click on the play date where you'll find all the rules to enter. It's free to enter and you have until midnight Eastern time on Wednesday, July 10th. What are we doing when we come back? We're doing some uh, some baby toys, but also some baby gear that uh, mom and dad will like. Ooh, we love baby gear. I know. We'll be right back. Baby boo boo, we're back, and you know what we just found out? We can you can text. You can, I guess you can Google this. You can you can text a, a, to to the some number. Diaper or the word diaper to uh, some number and, and you get this song. Have this song. So, on your phone. We're looking very sort of chic, I guess. We are. Although I'm, I'm not like into that sort of scarf look. Oh. Well, so it's not for me. I usually only wear. So big. 
I usually only wear scarves when it's cold outside, but some people like to wear them when for you know it's a fashion statement. But these are these not these are not scarves. These are swaddling cloths. That's right, actually. But they can be used, you know, after your child is grown, they can be used as uh, for a variety of different things. A blanket, a scarf, whoever else you want to use them. Um, our mom reviewer, Maria, you can watch her video review of these. She has a lot of suggestions for different ways to use these. She's really a fan of these. Um, they the are middle? from... What? What's the middle? It's it's, pa it's just oh, it's a padded. padded in the middle. It's padded it's in the padded middle. Square. So I guess it's sort of like when you're doing baby origami, you know, with the baby <laughs> ending up in the, in the middle. You know, I mean, swaddling is a very big mm -hmm. trend right now. My, my mother called it wrapping the baby up, but, but now we call it swaddling. I don't really know right. about swaddling as like wrapped in swaddling clothes and lying yeah, in a manger. Yeah, yeah, That's yeah, all yeah, they all yeah, I heard. Yeah. But, but, I don't but, think Mary had these. No, I don't think she had these. And these are very festive and, and lovely. And how much they are, are these? Um, this is, uh, you get two for $49.99. They are swaddle angel blankets from Munchkin. And they're actually they're actually really nice. The, the yeah. texture is, is really lovely. And I think that, it's uh, it's made from bamboo, actually. Bamboo. Um, and as our mom reviewer says, they feel a little rough at first. But once you wash them, they're really soft. Cool. Yeah. So, so if if you're swaddling, if you're swaddling, if you're swaddling, be well swaddled. Here you go. Yay! Okay. What's All next? Right. Let's talk about this little guy over here. This is from uh, B Kids Bobby Snuggle Bear. Oh, you're missing this key component. It comes with. Okay, so it's a nice soft little bear. You can play with it that way if you want to, because there's a little pocket in the back. But what you really do is you're inserting this little owl character. I'm going to turn it on. Let's make it be for the daytime. Can you see that light up? Okay, you can see it. So what I do is I put it in the back of my bear. Woohoo! And then when you squeeze the bear's tummy, you're supposed to be able to see it come through his little uh, stomach in here. Which the lights. I, again, I don't know if you'll be able to because the our lights are really bright. Yeah. This is they they do a really cute line of this. And so. then again, you can just take it out, sort of like a nice little fun toy ring. It also has a nighttime uh, mode, so it'll kind of like. Have soft music and the lullabies and the soft lights to soothe you to silly. Wake up! Get uh, back in there. Um, these are these are really cute, and you know we've been we've been expanding a lot of our baby coverage yeah. and baby toys because you know a lot of it is great for shower gifts, things like that. How much exactly. is this? This is uh, thirty nine ninety nine. So a great shower gift, something you know good for a boy or a girl. Yeah. It's really terrific. You know that we don't know point of the shower. So exactly. Okay. Exactly. So are we talking about these now? Let's talk about those. Okay. Surrey and the Oct Surrey the Octopus and Friends Sorry. teething toys. And Maria says this is the new gold standard, though they are not gold. They are <laughs> they are silicone. some they are silicone uh, standard for for uh, teethers. Yes, they're actually really dense. And mm -hmm. wait, Chris, how do you use the teethers? Well, I was gonna put it in my mouth, but <laughs> they're, they're dishwasher safe. <laughs> so <laughs> doesn't that help? <laughs> Oh. Exactly. Dishwasher safe. So these are going into the dishwasher before they yes. go to their ultimate home. Yes. But it's, I like, I actually could use this, you know, instead of the thing I wear at night to, to keep from <laughs> grinding my teeth. Yeah, yeah and they would be a lot less expensive than that That's thing. Right, exactly. So. Uh, but they've got a lot of little, little uh, bumps and yes. nubs on them so yes. that they're really stimulating the gums. Mm -hmm. And if actually if the baby like gets the anchor in the mouth, it's going to work on the back of the mouth too. Exactly. That's what they're designed to do. And I didn't even leave any teeth marks in this. Unlike my brother, I used to leave a lot of teeth marks in him. <laughs> so, so these are these are actually really yeah. cool. It's a set of three, and it is twenty two ninety nine for ages about three months and up, or you know, your teething baby. Or me. <laughs> um, and they also come in a separate, a different color scheme. You can get Surrey in yellow and some different colors. I like these. I, I like they're these. They're really nice. They're May, from Apple, May baby. Apple Baby. May Apple Baby, really, really kind yeah. of cool. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So we'll put that in this. I'm going to put this down here in the vat of disinfectant. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so this is the Daisy Box Castle from Quercetti. I hope I said that right. Quercetti? Quercetti. Yeah. Quercetti. It's Italian. It's Italian, I know. So we've got this fun little building plate here. Actually, this opens up. And all your pieces can be stored inside. Hey, Why has hey, it got hey. holes in the bottom? Your pieces need ventilation. Oh, okay. <laughs> You could put I a kit, you could put a kitten in there too, and it would be able to breathe. Why not? Sure. Oh. Let's try it. Let's try it. It's just great stacking for ages birth and up. It's um or where am I? It's for ages one and up. Nice rounded edges. Oh yes, look, and they fit yes. together in different ways. They do. Um, I like these. 
This is great. And again, for for fine motor skill, as as they're developing it, these are nice and rounded because really, you know, babies don't have the fingers, but they can mm -hmm. grasp it with this part of their right. hand, and so they're able to do the the putting and the taking yeah. type of play of that. And this is actually, I like what this looks like. Of course, it's well designed because it's Italian. <laughs> um, it's you can make a castle. You can make whatever you want. Just build. And they do have other sets, so you can kind of mix and match pieces from the different sets. This one is um, thirty dollars. I like the I like the finish on this. I think this is yes. really nice. And different nice pieces go a different way. I'm I'm not yeah. sure why the cloud thing, but that's all right. It kind of it's kind of well, neat it's, design. Well, it's, it's daisy, so it's sort of like it looks like a flower, really more. Really? Yeah, I think it's I a Rorschach it. test. It looks more like a cloud to me. You see daisies, I see what clouds. Does what does that mean? mean? Uh, it means let's talk about the next thing. Okay. <laughs> We have another toy. This is from Tomy in their Lamaze line. It's the Lamaze Shiver the Sharpay. Uh, it's a stroller toy or a car seat toy. It clips on nicely. It's got lots of different colors. Crinkles. Crinkles. Lots of textures. What happens if you pull the ring? Why don't you find out? I'll hold this. You pull down. Oh, look at that! It shivers! <laughs> it's not quite as good as, it's so fluffy! Oh, but, it's, okay. <laughs> but it's cute. It's still fun to do. Got nice little fun rings here and, you know, just something fun to keep baby's attention while you're on the go. And again, different colors, different play. textures, different things. There's there's some smooth and some shiny mm -hmm. stuff under here. So again, it's all about that. You know, at this age, it's all about that exploring and feeling and the different tactile things. Yeah. And, just, and the crinkle. We like the crinkles. I love crinkles. We like, we like it's the crinkles. so crinkly. It's ah. so crinkly. Ah. <laughs> Not quite the same. Did we say how much this is? That is $15.99. So really nice. Again, really yeah. something. Clip it on a stroller, clip it yeah. on the side of a crib. Clip it anywhere you'd like. So, okay. All right, so this is the comfy cradle. Doesn't look like a cradle, does it, though? It's a slip-on pillow, so that when you It looks like a big blood pressure thing. <laughs> like, I used to wear those to go swimming. Right, exactly. <laughs> no, this is, though, that you have something to, you know, rest your baby's head on your arm while you're nursing, while you're just carrying your baby, feeding your baby the bottle. Um, it kind of, it's really more for parents so that your arm doesn't get tired. <laughs> it's a nice padding and it kind of um, takes the weight and the pressure off of your arm so that it's a little bit more comfy. Wow, okay. You wanna try it? Yeah, I do. You wanna try it? Well, I feel like Anna Karenina now with my muff. <laughs> <laughs> It's well, actually, scary. a dad could use it too, just of for course, for yeah. her, because it does. You know, so many of these things that are designed for moms that, that oh, and it's got oh, Velcro it on it too. But so many of these things that are designed for, for yeah, moms, yeah. you know, a dad can't use as well. So yeah. it's like, but if you're holding them on, if I was holding a baby on an airplane, for example, yeah. you you would really want something like yeah. this to, to, to cushion it. It's sure. really soft. It is very soft. I know, right? And is this machine washable? Is it machine washable? It is machine washable. Yay! It machine is. washable. Yay! Yay! favorite thing I like like the teething thing oh it didn't dissolve yet in the disinfectant okay what's what's next all right last one we're going to show is something for the stroller this is the snooze shade plus from snooze oh, great. Shade. How, how beautiful a gray cloth <laughs> it attaches, it <laughs> let's go out and buy a gray oh no sorry. it attaches to almost any stroller with these velcro straps so you don't need any special tools or anything to get it on and what it has is... And what is the purpose of this? Well, I'm going to show Lori you. Imagine me as a stroller. Imagine me as a stroller, okay? Your baby's in the stroller. It's got this nice, like, mesh opening, so your baby is still breathable, but it's <laughs> keeping the sun out of your baby's eyes. And if your baby's sleeping and you don't want anybody to bother your baby, <laughs> I'm sleeping. Isn't that what it says on the front? It says, I'm catching okay. some, I'm catching some disease. disease, right? Yes, exactly. Right? So it kind of, um, it's very helpful for just keeping the sun out of your baby's eyes. Or, you know what, if you still want to, you can still open this up so that as you're riding, you can still, like, look down at your baby and say, hi, baby, if it's not a sunny day out. Make sure and he's still there. Make sure exactly. he's still there, you know? You know where I would want Poof. something like this? I would want something like this at, like, Disney World, where you're yes. pushing a child around all day in the sun mm -hmm. and... You know, if you're, or if you're out for a long afternoon, because yeah. you really don't want to expose them to the sun too exactly. much, too much. But uh, I think this is for your stroller handle, perhaps. Oh, um, it goes through the zipper area. Oh, perhaps. Perhaps. Because this has or to go around. To peek down at the baby. Well, that's or what that's this disturbing. is for. I don't think this is really going to give you much. But it's a zipper, and zippers are fun. <laughs> and you Lots can figure it out. Play. Lots of tactile play. Out. Meh. So and this is this is forty nine ninety nine. It is. Uh, this is the silver version. They also make just a, a plain black version. This is like there's a deluxe and an original. This is the deluxe. 
Because I think because of, oh, there's also a little pocket down here at the front because of the the material. You know, moms have so much stuff on their strollers these I days. Know, right? I mean, the stroller is like it's like a wheelbarrow with a baby in it. You know, <laughs> it's like with all the stuff that they have to carry around. So let's give away some stuff. Let's do. Uh oh, here it comes. Here we go. It's the it's the cloud daisy box. <laughs> no, it's the, the, the daisy box. <laughs> So Crayola washable sidewalk. Sixteen shop. colors, 16 just colors. like you see in the uh, in the Crayola That's box. Right. Very Love baby. these. Very baby. The snooze shade plus. This is in black. You're gonna get one of these for your baby. Ooh, oh. And <gasps> just hey, because baby. an alligator and a frog. You know what would be really cool is you got the baby in the snooze shade plus, and you reach in and you go, "Hello, little baby. I'm in here." <laughs> okay. That's what I would do. That's what you would do. Isn't that what any good parent would do? So to win these, come to time to play mag.com and click on the play date. And you'll find all the rules to enter. It's always free to enter and you have until midnight Eastern time on Wednesday, July 10th. So we hope you had a wonderful 4th of July. You're enjoying right. this weekend. That's right. And come play with us next week. We'll have more stuff. Can I make the frog sing? <laughs>